if I could pick anybody for a bull riding team, I, you know, I'd put, pick guys that were from, from my era. Tough was the most consistent guy for his entire career. Like, he, he's made the whistle more times than anybody in the history of bull riding as far as I'm concerned because he was still that consistent 15 years into it when he had to quit, you know, and and, uh, and Jim Sharp, his first six years, there's no debate about who's the best bull rider there ever was. For the next 10 years, Jim was human. He was still a good bull rider, but he was, so there, he had some injuries that changed him a little bit. He was still a really good bull rider, but those first six years, he would ride 50 in a row and get bucked off one and ride another 50 in a row. He's a 95% to 98% rider. Now, you know, that's unheard of. If you, you know, you're 70% rider, you're a world champion right now. So you think about that. So Jim was was that consistent. And then and Lane Frost, of course, he, he was so good. You know, he was so good. He didn't get to uh, finish it out. He was 25 years old when he died. And I got very little doubt that he'd have been He'd have been legendary. You know, those would have been the first guys I would pick. Those happen to be the guys I traveled with too, you know. Then there's Michael Gaffney and and uh, and Justin McBride, some other coaches in this league right now that would be my other picks. It would get really tough to pick all of those guys before you pick Jose, but that's how good Jose is. He fits right in with those guys. I'm Cody Lambert, and I'm proud to be the coach of the Texas Rattlers. <laughs>